So prosper, assets in abundance. So I want to talk to you, um, halfway through the presentation, I'm going to be showing you some slides, some um, websites, some services, some resources out there that can help you to do more. Okay, that extends your reach. That will help you to connect more, learn more, and be more prosperous. But first, I'd like to tell you a little bit about uh, myself. So my greatest joy in life is to play with my brother. It's all I really want to do. Okay, and when I say play, I don't mean it has to be video games. I just mean all of life to me is a game. This is a game, right? Work is a game, and I like to do that with my brother. So since we were young, I've always been hunting after him to try to do what he's doing, to be involved in the games that he's playing. Uh, it's a little tough because he's an overachiever, and he's smart, and he's bright, and he's light speed. He looks like me, but he's way better than I am. Uh, and so I, I've got to do, I've got to hustle. I've got to really hustle to get there. My brother, he learned how to do, um, to build websites. And he learned how to build websites so well that he works in it. And I'm not going to build websites. I mean, maybe I could do it. I just don't have the patience for it. And so um, I said, well, what is Tom doing that, uh, what is Tom not doing that I could do, that I might find fun? Now I love media, I love videos, and so I learned, I decided, let me learn how to create videos. And lo and behold, in the work that he does, a video editor, a video creator, a motion graphic designer is very useful. And so I learned that and I was able to play with him a little bit more. Then came stand-up comedy. He wants to be a comedian. I lived with my brother, I know him for 30 years, I never knew he wanted to be a comedian. And now it comes out of the blue, a comedian. And so I want to play with him. So I have to be a comedian too. I don't want to. I don't want to at all. I hate having to be entertaining. I don't mind being entertaining by accident. But I don't want it to be my job. But I do want to play with Tom. The reason I'm telling you this is because part of prosperity is engaging with the opportunities that are presented to you. Okay? And most of us, we get opportunities, but we don't want to do them necessarily. It feels awkward, it feels scary, it feels like it's outside of our comfort zone. But I got into my head that whatever opportunity was presented to me, that I would say yes. I saw this movie called Yes Man, right, yes. Jim Carrey, and I love, I love to say you can learn from anything. <laughs> you can learn from anything. And I learned from this movie and I said, let me try that. Let me just try saying yes to as much as possible. And so that's why I'm led here. So I didn't want to be a motivational speaker, I just knew that I could do it, and I knew it would be a fun way to get my brother's attention, okay? Because if you want to play with God, so you got like, to you got to be up there with him. So this is my way of trying to be like him. And over time, it took a few years, but I was able to rope him back in, and now he's playing with me. It's fun. So the way I achieve prosperity, the, my mission to achieve prosperity is not through the grind. It's through pleasure. It's through joy. You want to have a motivation. So let's get to it. So prosperity is a, it really is a byproduct of inspired action. Okay? Prosperity is not the goal you reach for. What you reach for is inspired action, inspired thought which leads to inspired action. You take that action and then that will give you the byproduct of prosperity. So let's get to it here. So the Latin, um, prosper comes from the Latin prosperi, which means according to expectations, according to one's wishes. Okay, that's very important. We're going to be talking about that soon. Pro in the uh, prosperi means to, to be for something, and spe is the, um, the prefix that means to thrive. Okay, so you're for thriving. Now, in order to get this, you have to understand that prosperity is growth. Okay, prosperity is growth. It's having more, having more. Prosperity is growth. Now, in order to have growth, you have the interplay of both positive and negative. Positive and negative things allow you to grow. Uh, the destructive process of eating food creates the constructive process of building you up. And so all of life um, depends on growth, meaning it depends on both positive and negative. But here I want you to pay attention to uh, these three words here, because that's what we're going to be talking about. Desire, expectation, and choice. So, whatever you are going to be doing, you're going to be doing because you are moved to, to do it. You're going to feel the impulse to do it. And that's why it's important to have a desire. You've heard someone tell you that you have to follow your passion in life, right? If you ask an entrepreneur, a business guy, how do I achieve prosperity, how do I achieve success in business, at first they're going to tell you to 
follow, uh, to be persistent, not to quit. Okay, don't quit. Start something, keep doing it, and don't quit. But then if you press them long enough, eventually they're going to tell you, you need to um, follow your passion, because you'll never be persistent in something that you're not passionate about. Does that make sense? So that's why desire is a crucial component. Some people do things just because it will give them money. And then they quit when it gets hard. Desire is what makes you push through. 